Hello and welcome to the session where we'll talk about a new feature in RBI 580, which will help optimize inspection cost by carrying out representative inspections. Best practices allow similar equipment to be grouped based on certain criteria like damage mechanism, equipment type and risk category. And it also allows actual inspections on a subset of that group which can represent inspections for the other equipments in the same group. Applicability, this is applicable for all process industries and wherever you are having an RBI 580 program. Value to the customer, it helps you further optimize the cost and saves you a cost by doing representative inspection. It also helps in efficiency because it helps you to create inspection plans based on grouping for thousands of assets. Again, uh, we worked with multiple customers on this feature and one of the customer insight was by implementing inspection group, they estimate to save about 30 to 50 percent on their ultrasonic testing cost. So let's get into the application to talk about this feature. To enter into inspection grouping, you have to navigate to risk space inspection overview page. The entry point to inspection grouping is under process unit, so you can get into the inspection grouping feature by selecting your process unit. In this case, I'll select the FCC unit. Click on open inspection group. Here on the left hand side, you can see all the groups that is created for that process unit. And if I click on plus, you can see how you can create various groups. You can group it by your damage mechanism, either it's corrosion under insulation or internal corrosion, and you can group it by equipment types and also by risk category. For today's demo, let's look into one of the examples that I have created, and this is a group for your vessels, for internal corrosion, for a medium risk, and it also groups by your process fluid. In this case, it's a C3, and the metallurgy is SA515. So based on that, it collects a group of three equipments. It sorts by its wall ratio and inspection priority, and says that you need to only inspect 10% of this population. So basically, you need to inspect only one asset in this group, which is E0012, E097, and that asset would represent the other two assets in the same group. So basically you only have to do inspection on the first asset and that inspection will give credit to the other two assets in the same group. So if I navigate to the other assets and open their inspection overview page, under the inspection tab, you can see that a general inspection is created and it will say that it's a represented inspection and the headline will say that actual inspection was performed on asset E0012 E097, which is the representative asset. So you can imagine that you know how you're reducing inspection on two components. So this is just an example, but if you look at a piping group, you could have say up to 100 components in the same group and you can further optimize your inspection. So I just talked about or one group, but you can have different types of groups based uh, for CUY2, right? So the next group is for another metallurgy, which is C3 and SA516. And you can see how different assets are grouped within the same group. So finally, with this feature, just want to highlight that it helps you group your similar components once you do your RBI 580 analysis and helps you optimize your inspection cost by doing representative inspection. And if you have any questions, please do contact.